turnover. Start event, a two on one with Moore. Alley oop. Yes, sir. Jalen Moore. Watch your head. Yellow Jackets high flying and pulling away. Boy, in Clayton State, they hit three of their first five three pointers. John, they've missed 11 straight now as that ball swatted away by Jalen Moore. Yellow Jackets in transition. No look bounce past the Maxwell. He'll go to the line as he draws the foul. Maxwell pulls the trigger on a three. Off the mark. Moore an offensive rebound. He hoists it high through contact and draws the foul. He's a guy that can step up for this Yellow Jackets team and strong finish there. He has started the year 6-0 and to the Orange. Unfortunately, have lost four in a row. Are bowl eligible, but love to finish the season strong, that's for sure. Another block. He's got four for North Alabama. Lane, the hero, a couple nights ago against Hampton. Game-winning and one with five seconds left. Oh, that was nice. Reverse lay-in. That's two games. Here you see the Jackets with the penetration. The scoop. Jordan. I really talked about trying to get out in transition, trying to make more opportunities beyond just the half court offense. Speaking of transition, here comes Coleman, and he lay it in for the Yellow Jackets' first points of the night. Largest Tech's lead has been 18 points. Make it 19. Largest lead of the night for Georgia Tech. Coach Wright was in his ear a little bit. Smith back for more. Three to shoot. Jalen a scoop with the left hand. What a tough shot. Somebody for Georgia Tech just has to step up and take open shot that ball got knocked away saved by Coleman here is Moore up and under Georgia Tech in front Davon Smith watches Roberts on the drive blocked out of there Jalen Moore with 7.6 left impressive rebounding from the point guard position six footer <laughs> no, he's not. <laughs> As you said, appropriate, Brian. Howard knocks it down. He had just 17 points in the first eight games he played this year. Jalen Moore rising up. He works through the contact, floats it in. He'll go to the line for one more. Eric Coleman. The contact, uh, playing great basketball since entering the starting lineup five games ago. A few other guys in the mix. In fact, if you take Miles Kelly... And Debo Coleman out of the mix. The rest of the team shooting below 30% from three. That one short, long rebound. It's McCoy. Here come the Hornets to Isaiah Range. He's trapped in the corner. And a turnover. Jalen Moore can fly. One more look at this steal and score from Jalen Moore. Moore getting into the bag. And Jalen Moore just wins it back. Rodney Howard cashes in the second chance points. And they're combined eight of 17 from the floor. They're playing at a high level, you know, in a losing effort, but you got to build on the positives if you're Coach Mallon. And Jalen Moore. He is, um, you know, I, I think they saw that. He was a late bloomer in high school. And you know. Anderson pestered by Maxwell. Gets a step and stuffed by Jordan Mecca. Alley-oop, yes, Jalen Moore with a roar to the baseline crowd. The alley-oop, we got it moments ago. Maxwell floating, Jalen Moore. In the man-to-man, -man, Georgia Tech likes to operate from the elbow. Kelly's three not there, offensive rebound, and put back by Jalen Moore. I was going to get into a fast start. There you see him with a great offensive rebound, great. Moore at the other end, muscles it in, plus one. You won that battle. Uh, I'm not going to let him walk or beat me <laughs> for a kid now. I mean, that's not good for the resume. Godfrey working out of the high post, has it go through his legs, and it comes to Moore. Pull up three, Kelly, yes. Turnover. Terry on the run. Popper trying to get back. Double fisted rim rocker from Lance Terry. Uh, here's the look, and uh, we talked about their ability to get out in the open floor. Nice finish by Mr. Terry. First team choices later on here during the game. Off the turnover from Kelly. 
hints it ahead of the pack. And he gets blocked by Jalen Moore. He's down block there. Timed it more, goes up. Oh, ball. And right now, Josh Bassett going to stick with the 1 3 1 zone. It's been working outside of Jaquavion Smith. No one else with a bucket yet. And a steal for Kelly, who gets the layup once again. Not many post guys can do that. They really don't talk with DJ prior to the game. I said, do you know Debbie Antonelli? Oh, as Jalen Moore has gotten off to a great start. You can go inside. You can go to baseline, short corner, somehow get behind the defense. That collapses. Another nice pass from Burns. <laughs> this, the, team, the opposing team is leaving you open for a reason. They want you to take that shot. to be able to go do that in game That's a action. great point. Jalen Moore. Benny. Here comes the Jackets again. Kelly ahead for Moore. Flying through the air and scoring. Nine for 13, delivering the goods in transition. And again, you see. Nice dish, and Howard finishes with authority. Right now they have up by nine, but they're doing what they can. Big fella finishes inside, let him swing on it. Jack is right now. It is, but you saw, again, the skill set of P.J. Hall. He's able to move his feet and stay in front. Here's Hall going for the dunk. Rubbed out of there, no foul. Newt Bowl was a teammate of mine. A lot of great talent. Lands the steal against Kelly. By Georgia Tech, Debo Coleman early, and then watch this individual spin cycle. Couldn't finish. Too much spin. Moore with the hammer. Trying to take that rim off its hinges and jam it at home for Georgia Tech. Smith, little hesitation move. Franklin scores it. Their singled out post game. After that big win, he said that his energy and positivity throughout the week was huge. Moore with a block of car. Jalen Moore, a shot fake. Attacks and finishes through the contact. Shot fake here in the corner. Just puts it down. Gets up. Hang time, baby. Got himself a ball game. Jordan check up, too. This is three-headed race. Uh, Three-horse race there at one point in time. And just ready for this hot take? I think Pittsburgh will get one of the double buys. More importantly, if the guard goes to score, he's getting to the offensive glass. See the note, he's got his fourth double-double. And then Lance Terry denies the lob to Marsh. Smith, right down the lane. You have 400 campers line up, yeah. and what a clock eater. <laughs> and then he'd, he'd mix it up. He'd make uh, him go left yeah. and reverse and make it more difficult, but the best camp drill ever. And Jalen Moore with a two-hand slam. And that ball was saved. Jordan Tech thought that was destined for the bleachers. Off the air ball bounce, and now a turnover. Terry to Moore! And it's a game that's been played from the rafters. Those are the decisions. Those are the decisions that are hurting him, and there it is on the other side. Jalen Moore sending shockwaves through the peak. Ankle injury as Mason Matson misses the three. Here's a three off the line. Good pass to the post and a conversion by Jalen Moore. So Georgia Tech. He has been slow to match up in the half court. Great pass by Sturdivant and Jalen Moore. Georgia Tech Yellow Jackets actually knocked me out of my first ever ACC tournament. <laughs> and there's an inside basket for Jalen Moore, a sophomore from Birmingham. And you see Franklin Zamore, more the only player that will come off the bench for Josh Pastor.